Eagles are an endangered species and designated as a natural monument, and the birds have visited the Korean Peninsula again to pass the winter. It has been found that the number of eagles are maintained at a stable level thanks to continued efforts to protect them. Next, we'll bring you a story about more than 90 eagles' life in Korea. Eagles soar into the blue sky in a flock. They land on the ground one after another and stage a fierce competition over prey. A rice field is filled with a flock of 97 eagles. Designated as a natural monument, eagles are a class two endangered species. After breeding in Mongolia and other northern regions, they arrive in the Korean Peninsula in late November to pass the winter. Eagles are birds of prey with their wingspan measuring more than two meters. However, they mainly live by scavenging dead animals. At one point, fewer than a thousand eagles visited the Korean peninsula due to a lack of food. There was even an incident that groups of eagles were poisoned to death. However, efforts to protect the species have produced positive results and restored the number to some 2,000. In a nationwide study conducted on January 26th, roughly 1,300 eagles were observed in Paju in Gyeonggi-do province, Tanyang in Chungcheongbuk-do province, and Kozong in Gyeongsangnam-do province. A large number of baby eagles were also born last year. <laughs> After spending the winter in Korea, eagles embark on a long journey in late February or early March to return to their homeland.